Hey there YouTube, today I'm going to show you another tech tip and that is how do you replace the CD-ROM for one of these Dell Optiplex 380s. Alright, so the first thing you got to do is open the case and that's done by go pulling on this tab in the top and then the side panel comes off just like that. And once you're in here uh, you take a look that this is the hard drive and this is the CD-ROM over here. To open up the CD-ROM, you pull up this tab up here and then you push the front of the CD-ROM in, just like that, and then you lift it out. And in the back you have the power and the SATA cable and you take those two out and you set them aside and that's it that's the that's the optical drive and the problem with this drive is that it's stuck it doesn't doesn't open so I'm gonna replace it with a another unit that I have that is also SATA and uh, that I know works alright so the first thing we gotta do is these you, this, these computers have a, a bracket that hold the CD-ROM in place, and they have uh, s three screws: one, two, and another one right there. Three. So I'm going to use a Phillips head screwdriver. I'm going to take my little magnetic tray. I'll take that one out. You take those three out and then on the side with the two screws, you just lift it up like that and the bracket comes off. So this one's defective. I'm going to set it aside. Now I'm going to get the, the new drive and I'm going to align the, the holes right there. Now, now you can see that the holes are aligned and I'm going to put the screws back in. and that's it the screws are back in that one and these two now you just got to reverse the process you get the power you plug it in you get the SATA cable you plug it in and then you align it right here okay now it's there and then you just slide it forward until it clicks. There you go. And now we're gonna power it up the computer. And I'll show you that it works. Take a look. And now that drive works as expected. That's it. So I hope you found this useful. This is how you replace the optical drive on a GX, sorry, on an Optiplex 380. And this also works with like the 755 or any of these computers that have the thin laptop style optical drive. If you like this kind of stuff, please subscribe and, uh, and uh, hit the like button and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.